guys welcome back to my channel today we're going to be doing a tutorial on how to lay your edges yes so we're gonna make this style pop because edges make your hairstyles pop so the first thing we're gonna need is a teasing brush some eco styling gel I do like the argan oil kind of best some Hicks edge control and some Jamaican black castor oil and you can get all of this at your local beauty supply store so first we're gonna start out with the Jamaican black castor oil. I like to rinse my edges out every night when I'm in the shower. So you're gonna be starting out with a clean slate and I just rinse them off with water, not like shampoo every day. Shouldn't do that anyway. So you're gonna need to moisturize your edges so they don't fall out because your hair, when it's curly and kinky, it's very fragile. So you gotta keep them guys moisturized. All right, so next we're gonna be taking our Hicks Edge Control. And you're not gonna take a lot, you're gonna do a little at a time. So just scoop it out and just dab it on your edges, like so. So yeah, we're looking real crazy right now, but at the end, it'll all be worth it. All right, so next we're gonna go ahead and take our teasing brush. I really like this brush. I prefer it over the edge brushes because the bristles are really hard and it has a rat tail at the end and you can make loops in your edges, do whatever you want, and it lasts longer. But anyway, what we're gonna do is just swoop, brush it down and swoop. Okay, so I like to leave my sideburns out because it's like just more dramatic and yeah, you don't have to. You can just brush it up into the rest of your hair if you want. But yeah, I like my little loops. All right, and on to the other side with your swoop action. All right, so the finishing touches, I like to add a little dab of eco styling gel just because it holds it in place better. And Hicks is great and all, but like it doesn't like to stay in place for like all day. So I like to top it off with some eco styling gel. y'all final step you already know how this goes go ahead and put your scarf on the front of your hairline and do not tie it tight not only will it ruin your edges at the end it just will give you a headache so it's so unnecessary and just leave it on for like 10 or 15 minutes and you're done All right, so when you're taking your scarf off, make sure you're doing it slowly and gently. And yeah, it's gonna lay. Yup, we got to lay this 4C hair. All right, y'all. Well, I hope y'all enjoyed my little tutorial. Make sure you subscribe and hit that like button. And yeah, let me know how it goes. Bye.